football helmet is one of the most important parts of a football player's equipment. Uh, the football helmet prevents brain injuries that could eventually lead to death and a serious, serious injury, if not death. Uh, one of the most important parts of the football helmet is the face mask. Keeping, ma making sure your face mask is maintained and updated is a very important process because if you don't, it could lead to injury. Uh, today I'll be showing you how to change your face mask. What you'll need is a new face mask, which I don't have because uh, I don't own one yet. And so I'll just be replacing this one. You'll also need a drill or a screwdriver with a Phillips head end. To start off, what you do is you pull the inside padding out of your football helmet. It's attached by Velcro, so you can just pull that off and set them aside. Now, what you will find is that your face mask is attached by four Phillips head screws, followed by T-nuts on the inside that hold them in. What you want to start off by doing is taking off your side screws first. You may need help with a drill for this. You lay your, your screw aside and you lay your T-nut aside as well. Then you go to the other side. After taking your side screws off, you'll find that your helmet is only attached by two more screws in the top. Now you want to take these off and lay them aside as well. Now you'll take the last screw off of your face mask to get it free from the helmet. After doing this, your helmet should be able to come off with ease, your face mask. At this point, you would want to take your other face mask, which I don't have, so I'll be using this one again and put it back on. To do this, you do the exact opposite of what you did. You put, replace the center, the center screws first. You wanna take one T-nut and line it up in the hole that your helmet goes in. After this, you take your screw and line it up as well. Then you put it back in. You must make sure every screw is tight for the, uh, so your face mask isn't mobile, uh, which would lead to a possibility of injury. Then you do your second center screw again. Want your, you want your screws to be as tight as they can. Then you do your side screws again. <coughs> now for your last screw.
Now, after getting your helmet and your face mask reconnected, make sure your helmet is tied as it can be with your face mask so it is not loose while you're flying. After this, you wanna start with your center pad for your helmet. Reattach it to the Velcro and make sure it's stable. Then you take your side. One should say left and one should say right. You take your left side and put it on the left side of your helmet. Put it in place with the Velcro and make sure it's stable as well. Then you take your right side and do the same. Now make sure everything is tight so you're not injured on the football field. And now you're ready to go out and play. That's how you change the face mask on a football helmet. Thank you.